Hey friends, welcome back. My name is Kapil. Welcome back to Dig with Geek. And today I'm going to talk about how you can actually run a Windows based software on your Mac or maybe not exactly on a Mac but something like that without using Parallels or VirtualBox or VMware or Wine. No such crap, nothing. This even works on Intel based Mac as well as uh, Apple Silicon, the new M1, M2 chips. And not only this, this setup actually even works for your iPhone, your iPad. You can basically run Windows software from any device you want. So how are we going to do it? So basically this setup will work even from your Windows machine, even from your Linux PC if you have one. And as I told you, iPad and iPhone, Basically any device that is connected to internet and you can use it 24 by 7 there is no restriction so for this all you need is a KVM VPS that supports Windows so for this you can get it from hostium.com or any other provider that provides KVM VPS just it should be a reliable provider just make sure of that so for in this example I am going to use this gigabit VPS 3 package it costs US dollar 5 per month so that comes down to approximately rupees 400 actually less than rupees 400 per month so we are going to use this package basically it works from any on any package above gigabit vps3 so you can take whatever you want depending upon how much disk space you need so let's get started so how this works i have got this vps now i'm going to connect to this vps so for connecting to this vps what are we going to do we need remote microsoft remote desktop it's available in the app store see just search for microsoft remote desktop and it's over here i already installed it so I'll, you can actually use any remote desktop software but microsoft itself provides so i'm just using it because there are no bugs no issues no security concerns nothing like that so that's okay let's add the pc first so i will just give you the ip address of my vps and a friendly name demo vps and Fine, fine, what else? Displays. Fit session to screen. I mean, you can actually adjust this later on, but okay, fine. Now let's connect to it. It's asking for username and password. I got it in email, so I will just using that. You will, once you order, you even you will get this username and password. Or you can take help your VPS or you, or you can take help of your VPS provider to you for uh, like uh, to show you how to connect. So that's how we are connecting. So here it is. Now, as you can see, I have a Windows running on my Mac without actually hogging my like MacBook resources because it's not consuming any resource at all. It's not taking the CPU, RAM, disk, nothing. So my MacBook performance is as it is and I'm still able to access Windows. Now in this Windows, I can actually install whatever software I want. So I have opened this and now I will just install, let's install Chrome. Let's install some software. So let's try, start with Chrome. First go to Google and please know like this is a base standard Windows system so you can actually install uh, or basically install all Windows updates and everything so let's install okay it's already recommended and it's searching download Chrome so I'm just downloading it run on your Mac Let's set go and you can actually even make it full screen just see oh yeah just click so basically now you have a full screen windows it's installing windows the minimize internet store it's not needed so google chrome is installed now suppose let's install something else uh, Uh, 
okay download skype for mobile windows okay this is it get skype for windows and it's downloaded already because this is on a high speed connection so you get the benefit of this you can actually install microsoft office like each and every software you want but like uh, one more thing uh, like you need to actually secure this vps uh, if you want me to make a video on that let me know in comments i will make a video on that also this is how can you can secure it because this is online 24 by 7 actually this is a server that's running windows for you so if you want me to make any such video let me know see skype install and running all you need to do is just provide your username and password and it will start working so in this way basically you can install any software you want so you have full access to windows and you can actually access this even from your ipad or uh, iphone like this microsoft remote connect is app is available on all uh, like uh, platforms even windows and linux even android so actually in, in this way you get access to windows from all operating system all your devices now if you have something running over here you can actually switch device anytime you want and you will get the same thing every like each and every time you like even if you change device you still have access to the same content from everywhere it's like a cloud you can say sort of so basically this gives a perfect environment to test any software like suppose if you're into software review or something or if you just want to test out some windows software so you don't need to like uh, get a windows pc for that just get this small vps and you can run your software on it not only this you can actually even copy paste content like if you have a text in your uh, mac system just select it command c and over here just go here and use control v you know, like on the uh, remote desktop window press control v not command and it will paste it over there and not only this like all these vps at least hostions they have option to allow custom uh, software or custom operating system now suppose if you want to install windows 10 or windows 11 you can just log into the vps control panel provide link to the iso so you even don't need to upload the whole iso just provide the download link to the iso and it will give you direct dvd of windows 10 over there or windows 11 whatever you want to install and you can actually install that and just enable remote desktop in it and you can access it anytime so actually you can install any operating system you want in this way and you get access to it without installing parallels vmware or any any such crap on your mac so this is the biggest advantage and plus it's accessible globally you even if you're on the move or somewhere you still can access it and now if i want to minimize this window or like resize it okay let's just click over here and fine now it's in the window form again so i hope you like the video i hope you like this concept of sort of running windows on your mac without actually installing it on your mac so that's all for this video i hope you like the video make sure to like click the like button do click on the subscribe button as well and make sure to click on the bell icon and let me know in comments if you want me to make uh, like a video on how to secure your vps or maybe how to install windows 10 or windows 11 using iso uh, on your vps so that you can actually access it from back and uh, different operating system or different devices so bye bye for now have a great day